This book is called Farmer Duck and it's written by Martin Waddell. Whilst we're reading today, I want us to think about the main character, the duck. Whilst you're listening to the story and looking at the pictures, think of some words that might describe the character of duck. Let's take a closer look at the cover of the book. I can see the title, Farmer Duck. I can see the name of the author, Martin Waddell, and the illustrator, Helen Oxenberry. And I can see Duck, and he's working away there on the land. Here is the blurb of the story. There once was a duck who had the bad luck to live with a lazy old farmer. While the duck worked, the farmer lay in bed. Until one day, the other animals decided to take action. Oh, I wonder what action they're going to take. Imagine a lazy farmer letting the duck do all of the work all day. Hmm, this could be interesting. Let's read on. There once was a duck who had the bad luck to live with a lazy old farmer. The duck did the work. The farmer stayed all day in bed. The duck fetched the cow from the field. How goes the work? called the farmer. The duck answered, Quack! The duck brought the sheep from the hill. How goes the work? called the farmer. The duck answered, Quack! The duck put the hens in their house. How goes the work? called the farmer. The duck answered, Quack! The farmer got fat through staying in bed and the poor duck got fed up with working all day. How goes the work? Quack! 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 The poor duck was sleepy and weepy and tired. The hens and the cow and the sheep got very upset. They loved the duck. So they held a meeting under the moon and they made a plan for the morning. Moo, said the cow. Bah, said the sheep. Cluck, said the hens. And that was the plan. It was just before dawn and the farmyard was still. Through the back door and into the house crept the cow and the sheep and the hens. They stole down the hall. They creaked up the stairs. They squeezed under the bed of the farmer and wriggled about. The bed started to rock and the farmer woke up and he called, How goes the work? And... Moo, ba, cook. They lifted his bed and he started to shout and they banged and they bounced the old farmer about and about and about, right out of the bed. And he fled with the cow and the sheep and the hens, mooing and baying and clucking around him. Down the lane, moo, through the fields, ba. Over the hill, cluck, and he never came back. The duck awoke and waddled wearily into the yard, expecting to hear, How goes the work? But nobody spoke. Then the cow and the sheep and the hens came back. Quack, asked the duck. Moo, said the cow. Ba, said the sheep. Cluck, said the hens which told the duck the whole story. Then, mooing and bang and clucking and quacking, they all set to work on their farm. The end. Remember at the start of the video, I asked you to listen to the words and look at the pictures, to think about the character of the duck. I wanted you to think of words that would describe him. Did you come up with any? The first word I came up with was tired. 
Poor Duck was tired a lot because he had an awful lot of jobs to do. And all those jobs, all that work made him fed up. Poor Duck. But at the end of the story, remember Duck woke up and he was waiting for more jobs from the farmer? But then the cows and the hens and the sheep told him what had happened and Duck felt quite happy.